How do you do, hopeful? Seeking prestige, yes. Do you know of our renegade student? Those are the ones. It seems you have already heard of them. There is little more I can tell you then. Should you locate their hiding place, you would gain considerable prestige, I am sure. Now, if you will excuse me, I must return to my studies. Sorry, if Master Uthar gives you an order, you'd better follow it. There were some students who disobeyed him, and now they're hiding out on the surface somewhere. Sorry, I don't have time to speak. My train... Come back when you've taken your final test, if you survive it. You hanging around? That's right. You might as well just go home, you know. There can only be one Sith this year, and that's me. You think I would tell you? Have my brain started dribbling out of my nose or something? Hmm. I guess there's no harm in it. Word has it that Master Uthar gives big points for Sith artifacts that are brought back from the valley. The Valley of the Sith Lords. You know, where the Academy does all its excavating. If you really don't know, just go out the east exit and you'll see. I understand you have impressed Master Uthar at least a little. That is good. We are one step closer toward completing my plan. Were I you, I would not get too excited just yet. You still have plenty left to do. I have been involved in the work there over the last couple of years, but not often. Most of the excavating is left to the students. What did you wish to know? Not unless you are accompanied by Master Uthar, no, it is strictly forbidden. And I truly doubt you could bypass the doors to the tomb with anything less than ship blasters. Even then, perhaps. As you wish. You must impress Master Uthar. Go to him with news of your deeds, or artifacts you have discovered. The rebel students I told you about must still be found and dealt with. Master Uthar would be greatly impressed by their deaths, I am sure. The only other idea I can suggest to you is that you head into the Valley of the Dark Lords on the surface. There are ancient ruins there which can be explored. It's possible you might find some artifacts or information in them which would please Uthar. It's difficult to say for certain. I hope to see you again.
Kabuksha. Kung kumbi. Kung hai wang yu jung lung tol pa da bong wan yu yam yu nangu. Mana man atota. Haki jukra ta pula shui chunga tong. Watana. あ、ちょっとここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、ここ、
Well, the legends say the sword had dark power. But that may only be a story. We will never know unless we can examine it more closely. You simply need to follow the East Passage. There's an exit there which will lead you up to the surface. Look for Tariga. She is in that area and can probably help you. I imagine you've got a lot to do. Sorry, I don't have time to speak. My training waits. No problem. Got it. Go away. There's no get lost. I'm not falling for any of your tricks. If you're here to use the dueling room, go ahead. I'm through with it for the moment. Don't be foolish. If Uzar wants to send an order, he can bloody well tell me himself. Don't be foolish. Darth Malak is one of the greatest Sith leaders ever. Back to the account. If you're here, this is where you get to hone your killing styles. We get sent captains all the time to practice on. It's very. Good. No thanks. I'm pretty pushed right now. Maybe later. Don't be. If you're here, just go to the... This is where you... It'd be a waste just to execute. At least this way, they're useful. You only get so many before the terminal cuts you off. Some of the students are a little bloodthirsty and get carried away, after all. But why? It'd be a waste just to execute them. At least this way, they're useful. No. Maybe later. Don't be fooled. Maybe you can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals.
Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned, not executed. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Yutha. No problem. Got it. What are you, ma? Wama huhu nandetik. Ah, shotumi batoga. Wano kuspe ching palabule donke. Ki puna! Kava dumpa ku pelea muka bata! Ji yoko ku dumpa ku pelea! Rondadihotonga Ranu prata dogo shirkasha jum apike na tipuna kudu tijiba chipikaza dopo pache jone jikyo kolawish we eat nam tatia kun tichadai tumpa tuka smaktelia what what have you done i told you not to put the prisoner into shock didn't i now, how are we supposed to find out where the weapon cache is? Yutha will be furious. Ah, I may as well take this fool and dump him somewhere. It's useless to us. I cannot believe you are so incompetent. Sith from the Academy, yes? Would you happen to be looking for new prospects? You own the Ebon Heart, don't you? Nice to see you. This kind of so key, Hey, what's this? Looks like we found ourselves a bit of sport, my friends. Ever notice how the Sith always act tough when they're in groups? Nothing but scum, if you ask me. This is good. I want to celebrate my acceptance into the Academy. Me too. So how about it, chump? Ready to die? I'm eager to blow off some steam after those tests. 
But we do, isn't it obvious? Yeah, I don't want to fight you. Hey, that's a Jedi trick. What? You, you won't get away with this. Uh, you're a Sith, right? Excuse me. Go about your business, please, citizen. I suppose you've heard about the destruction of Taurus, yes? Awful business, that. We do some mining. Our stop this off, if you're... Certainly. Zerka sends freighters. The men are not allowed... Well... All I know is that they call the site the Valley of the Dark Lords. Apparently, there are Sith Lords of old buried in tombs there. I don't... Do come again. Once you become a Sith, you can do anything. You can feel the power coursing through you. None of you fools can compare to me. We eat a na, dana titai, jipi kasa, kingu wa muli radwana, kachopa bogra shonko ta chita. Please! You're jealous. You're jealous of my power. You think you deserve this medallion, don't you? I have the power to do anything! Pudu, Tuni Rama na praka donko tsercha, chupatanki. Sniveling fool! That you would ever belong beside me in the academy. I'd rather kill you now and save us the trouble. What's this? It seems I have an audience. Look, Jedi, just keep walking. Unless you want some of the same. You can't stop me! You first, human! And you need? 
Well, there isn't much to do in Dreshte, except have a, uh, you're a Sith, right? <clears throat> Excuse me. You are one of the Sith from... You are so lucky! Something on your mind, do you? No, I never did, did I? Elusive? Me, elusive? <laughs> Obviously, you've never tried to grab a Twi'lek dancing girl after drinking too much Andoran Willick juice. At any rate, I already told you why I wanted to leave. I'd seen everything I wanted to on Kashyyyk. Time to go. Time to move on. You live in an overgrown stump with a tax beating down your door, and you tell me how happy you would be. I was pleased just to have visitors. How many kilometer high trees can you find an interest in before you figure you've had enough? I bet you can't be bothered to stay in one room for more than 15 minutes. And then there's all the critters in the Shadowlands. I'm just happy to be back in space, doing something new. Is that too much to ask? There. Now, was that so hard? An old man has to be allowed some petty eccentricities. Nice to see you agree for once. I'll admit, for all its flaws, Kashik was home enough. But when you came along and I saw the destiny you had before you, I couldn't help but be intrigued. Of course not. Weren't you listening last time? I can see that you have a destiny before you. But the details are far from clear. In fact, everything about you that I can see is odd. Slightly off, as if my eyes are trying to trick me. Something... something is very dark about you. But... Ah, I'm sure you don't need to hear my ruminations. You've probably got enough nosy Jedi offering you one opinion after another to make you sick. Your future will come of its own accord, trust me. Sometimes navel-gazing at it doesn't get you anywhere. I wouldn't worry about it too much if I were you. You remind me a bit of Nomi. <laughs> that can't be all bad. Nomi Sunrider. She came late to the Force, just as you have, and became one of the greatest Jedi ever. Oh, fine, fine lass. Whether you'll follow the same path remains to be seen. For one thing, we'll never get anywhere if you stand around chatting up old men all day. Stop being such a baby. Are you always so quick to turn aside an ally? Got too many of them, do you? One thing I will say is that this little escapade does remind me a bit of my adventure in days before the war. Ah, those were exciting times. Or at least it would remind me of those times if we didn't stand around. What's keeping you? You're too young to be so talkative. Shoo! Shoo! Greetings, young one. I have found you to be most impressive. You are off to an excellent beginning. You do? That is most interesting. Where might that be? 
Hmm. How ironic that I recently had his vessel scrapped for parts, then. I had assumed it had been thoroughly scanned. Apparently not. Still, you have done well in bringing me information that others could not unearth on their own. I am impressed. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Very well. You have impressed me. Definitely a good start. someone else had killed you and deprived me of the pleasure, you may have defeated the pathetic bounty hunter my master sent after you. But you are no match for me. I have studied at the foot of the Dark Lord himself. Your words mean nothing to me, unless you wish to beg for your life. No, then I shall try to make this both quick and painful. Your will. Yeah. Uh, 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 u
Hold it right there, whoever you are. We're not going back to the Academy. We'll kill you rather than go back. You mean you aren't here to kill us or bring us back? I find that hard to believe. The only way into these caves is through the Academy. You must be a Sith. So what is it then? If you're not here to kill us or bring us back, why are you here? Speak up! So you have heard about us. Yes, we ran away before Master Uthar could execute us. Is that so hard to believe? My name is Thalia May. The others here and myself refused to murder a bunch of people on a whim from Master Uthar. So here we are. We thought that becoming a Sith was what we always wanted, but that wasn't true. Now all we want is to get out of here. Fair enough? Help us? Why should I believe that this isn't some kind of trick? You want to help us? All right, I can think of a way. We're stuck in these caves, obviously, or we would have been long gone. There's a passage to the surface through the caves, but we're blocked by some kind of large creature. We can't defeat it. If you could kill it and clear up the passageway for us, we could escape. That would be help enough. Can you do that? I'll believe that when I see it. But if you could, we would be grateful. Sure. 
Is there news? Is the passageway clear? All right, we'll keep waiting then. Watch out for that beast, it's dangerous.
So, is there news? Is the passageway clear? It... it's clear? We can go. Thank you. This... I wasn't expecting help from anyone in the Academy. I guess we aren't the only ones who don't... agree with everything. Maybe. Maybe the Jedi will accept us. I've seen how evil the dark side is. Maybe I could try. At any rate, thank you again. You've saved our lives.
I'm not here to get you out of trouble if you do something stupid, student. Enter the tombs at your own. The tomb on the far left there, it's off limits. Only Master Uthar can go inside. Sorry, I can't talk. We have to excavate this valley with hand instruments. I'm not here to get you out of trouble if you do something stupid, student. Look, unless you're willing to lend a hand, leave us to our work. Oh, hello to you. You're new to the Academy, aren't you? I can't say we've ever met. I've been working on a translation of some of the runes by this tomb. I'm quite excited. This may very well be the tomb of a giant Paul. The runes say that he was interred here, so well, I, I think it may indeed be possible. Whoever found the sword could gain great prestige. Well, a few of the Boulder students have tried. They did not return. As I understand it, the tombs are quite dangerous. From what I've been told, the tombs have old traps and machines that are still active. They were designed to keep out intruders when they were made, and still do. I suppose if the Academy wanted to make a concerted effort, the tomb would be opened. But I think Master Uthar prefers to keep it as a challenge for the students. Nothing at all. The legends don't say anything about it. It may have had powers only for Ajanta alone. No, these tombs are certainly not harmless. Don't think that. The sword may be tempting, but I'm not about to risk my life to find it. Certainly. Finding such an artifact and giving it to Master Uthar would earn anyone big points. Although I suppose you can also keep it. Of course. Don't let me keep you from your business. You aren't assigned to the excavation team, are you? There you are, finally. If you were any later in showing up, we would have had to abandon this. I've been calling to the Takata mother in their language. She should respond fairly... Ah, here she comes now. Get ready. This will not be easy. She's a tough beast. dead. We work better together than I would have hoped. And here is the holocron. Such a small thing to be so valuable and require so much effort to obtain. I'll just run along now and give this to Master Uthar. I'll be sure to tell him of your contribution, naturally. Forget it. I'm not waiting up for you. That wasn't our plan anyway. Over my dead body!
Go about your business, please, citizen. I understand you're receiving training at the monastery. You certainly can. by the door. Just be careful if you go into the valley. I hear there's a hermit living in the hills that kidnaps students. Ha! <laughs> 
what? Dark, I am disturbed again. Oh, a human. Beware this. This spirit, it may not be what it appears. Great emotion lies within. A Jedi here? Why have you come to this dark place, Jedi? Why disturb my sleepless rest? I had a name once. Ajunta Paul. Yes, that was my name. I was one of many. We were servants of the dark side. Sith Lords, we called ourselves. So proud. In the end, we were not so proud. We hid. Hid from those we had betrayed. We fell, and I knew it would be so. Our Jedi Masters. Those who had taught us to use the Force, who warned us against the dark side, yet we embraced it in secret, reveled in its power. We were... discovered? Or did we act? I, I can no longer remember. But here is where we came, to hide, to grow, and here we fell. Ancient. Has it been so long that you use the word ancient? I have been here so long, so lost, I cannot, cannot remember. We were the first, the first to rebel, to betray, to surrender ourselves to the dark side. So strong, we thought, so wrong. We hid from the Jedi, but it was not they who destroyed us. Is it not obvious what we did? We destroyed each other. 
we desire the secrets of each other to increase our power. We battled until finally our fortress rained down on top of us. And so, here, our old secret is buried, and none of us hold it anymore. Is that not right? Our power fled. Oh, what became of us? Do, do the Sith still thrive? Did they ever return? So much, so much time has passed, and yet we have learned nothing, nothing. My sword, I filled it with my pride, and it is buried with me now. A corpse, as I am a corpse. I am dead as my faith is dead, and I shall remain here, surrounded by blackness in death as in life. Of course you do. You seek my power. Will it destroy you as it did me? I wish my sword to be taken away from here. I do not wish it to rot away as I have. I command this of you. If, if you are wise, you will not keep it in the end. It is what destroyed me. There are three blades within my sarcophagus. Only one is truly my soul. But it has been so long. I do not remember which. Find the soul that is mine and place it on the statue. If it is truly mine, then it is yours. Then you must die. This is how it must be. I do remember one thing of my soul. Listen to me carefully. I am that which grips the heart in fright. Harkens night and silences the light. It was written of my sword long, long ago. Go then, find my sword and place it on the statue. That is the blade that destroyed me. Take it. Take it and the other blades even. Take them and go. My darkness awaits me. Our oldest secret is buried, but not here. I remember nothing else. I cannot help you. No need? What choice have I? Return? But I betrayed my old masters. They would never let me return to the light side. It is too late. Too late. If... if I could return... Oh, my master, it has been so long, and I regret so much. Worm actually made it through the tomb. I'm impressed. 
impressed. Isn't it obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work in retrieving the sword of Ajunt Paul for some time. It's been quite a wait. Now that you have it, I just thought I'd relieve you of it. It must be quite a burden after all. Oh, but I insist. I'm not about to let a chance to impress Master Uthar pass me by. Especially not for a pathetic excuse for a Sith like yourself. Hand over the sword, worm. You know I'm the superior here. This isn't a negotiation. As much as I dislike ultimatums, I'm afraid I must stoop. Hand over the sword or die. Isn't it obvious? You die. Rule of the Sith. Only the strong and cunning shall survive. You won't be missed, trust me. Now hand it over. Fine. No tricks, though. I'm watching you. Smart move. You're obviously more pathetic than I could have even imagined. Thanks for the sword, worm. You! You have the sword! The sword of a gentle ball! That's it, isn't it? How did you ever acquire it? Are you joking with me? The Sith Lord still lives? Oh, that is quite interesting. Uh, my mentor told me that Sith apparitions might be possible, but I never truly believed it. Well, thank you for the information. I must go and inform my mentor at once of this strange news. You should be careful if you're planning on entering this tomb. It's dangerous. There's an assassin droid in there, so Master Uthar says. It went insane and is holed up in there with a whole army of droids protecting it. I don't know. I think Master Uthar has left it in there as a challenge for any student brave enough to destroy it. Supposedly, if a student actually succeeds in destroying the droid, they'll get a great reward. Lots have tried, but nobody's succeeded yet. No idea. I think it's building them in there. I don't know. I think Master Uthar... Suppose... I... I don't think so. I can manipulate minds and living matter, but that won't be much use against droids, will it? I've had a few friends go inside that haven't come out for a while now. I doubt I could do any better than they could. Seems that way. They say that its audio receptors became too sensitive and all the noise drove the droid nuts. If you're planning on going in, I suggest you use some sound suppressors or something. Or you'll probably become a target right away. Sure thing. Good luck. Intruders detected. Intruders audio input. Initiate attack sequence.
Too much audio input. Audio systems overloading. Must destroy source of disturbance. Must kill sentience. What is it? What? I heard an explosion in there. Did you destroy the assassin droid? Oh well, I guess it's good that the deed is done. Hope you stomped it good for my friends. At any rate, if you haven't already, you might want to go and see Master Uthar about that reward. Prestige is gold, you know. 